Who would win? Polar Bear versus Grizzly Bear by Jerry Palota. During the Arctic winter, polar bears and grizzly bears live far away from each other. But during the summer months, while looking for food, polar bears and grizzly bears sometimes end up in the same location. What would happen if they met each other? What would happen if they had a fight? Who would win? Meet the polar bear. Polar bears are considered sea mammals. They spend most of their time on the frozen sea. They prefer to live near the edge of, an, of the ice pack. They are the largest of all bears. Meet the grizzly bear. Grizzly bears are mammals that live on land. You can tell that you can tell grizzlies by the huge hump at their shoulders. This is the muscle they use for digging. Sorry, black bear. You are not in this book because you are not as big and ferocious as grizzly as grizzlies and polar bears. Forget about it, giant panda. You are a plant eater, and you are no match for a polar bear or a grizzly bear. Polar bears have snow white fur. Their color allows them to blend in with their environment, snow, slush, and ice. Grizzly bears come in four different colors, dark brown, brown, reddish brown, and blonde. These colors allow grizzlies to blend in with their environment, fallen leaves, dirt, rocks, and trees. Polar bears are the largest predatory anim land animals. Polar bears can grow to be 10 feet tall. Here is a kindergartner next to a polar bear. A grizzly bear can stand eight feet tall. They tower over you. A polar bear paw is larger than this book. This is a grizzly track. A track is a footprint their front claws can be four inches long. Polar bears are excellent swimmers. They can swim farther than 50 miles at one stretch. Polar bears are sea. Polar bears mostly eat f meat from the ocean. Walrus, seals, sea lions, and fish. Seals are their favorite food. Grizzly bears are good swimmers but they prefer standing in a river to catch fish. If a grizzly stands in the right spot, a migrating salmon might jump right into its mouth. Open wide, polar bears, polar bears have carn carnivore, carnivore teeth, Canin, canine teeth in front of and huge molars in back. Grizzly bears have teeth that are similar to a polar bear's. Grizzlies have such a good sense of smell that they can detect a dead animal 10 miles away. A polar bear can run 25 miles per hour. That is faster than a human can run. Polar bears can run down some caribou. So who would win if they had a fight, the polar bear or the grizzly bear? Grizzly bears look slow, but they but don't be fooled. Grizzly bears can easily outturn a human. They are fast. Here is a polar bear skeleton. Bear skeletons are somewhat similar to a human's to a human's. Four limbs, five fingers, five toes, toes, backbone, ribs, head, neck and hips. Here is the complete skeleton of a grizzly bear. Polar bears are solitary animals. They rarely fight each other and mostly they stay away from each other. Grizzly bears are also solitary animals but groups of grizzlies sometimes fish dur together during a salmon migration. 
Male polar bears do not hibernate. They spend all winter looking for food. They might build a snowman, snow cave to sleep away an unusually bad storm. Female polar bears uh, build a mat maternity den, usually in the snow and ice, to spend winter and take care of their cubs. This conserves the mom's energy. Just before winter, grizzlies eat as much as they can to fatten up for a long sleep. Grizzly bears have a deep sleep, have a deep winter sleep. What is it? But it is not true hibernation. A grizzly, a grizzly can wake up and suddenly attack you in the springtime. Grizzlies are hungry. Watch out. A U.S. Navy nuclear sub surfaced in the Arctic ice only only to find a few polar bears snooping around. Sometimes polar bears take naps in the funniest of positions. A famous nature photographer waited for days to get a good picture of a polar bear. He was eating lunch in his pickup truck. One day he one day when he saw a Big surprise in his rear, rear view mirror. An Alaskan man come home to find a grizzly bear relaxing in his jacuzzi. A sailor anchored in a harbor in Alaska was awakened by a noise. He found a grizzly walking around his yacht. Scared out of his wits, he pushed the grizzly off with an oar. Using a cheeseburger, a tourist lured a grizzly bear into his car. The foolish man wanted to get a nice picture of the bear sitting with his wife. The woman screamed and the confused bear ran away. It is summer. A polar bear steps off the ice onto a beach. A grizzly bear comes out, out of, comes out of the woods. They see each other they can smell each other. Both bears stand to get a better look. Then it happens. The glizzy charges at the polar bear, growling and showing his teeth. The polar bear crouches down, paws up, ready for battle. Running at full speed, the grizzly knocks over the polar bear. The polar bear gets right up and, and fights back. Whap! He smacks the grizzly in the face. Ouch, they claw, scratch, and bite. It's a nasty fight. They wrestle, each trying to get the advantage. Rolling around, both bears get dirty from, from the sand and mud. The grizzly is relentless. It keeps on fighting. Suddenly, the polar bear sees no point in fighting anymore. There is no reason to, f there is no reason to fight to the death. Polar bear runs away. The grizzly went, but now he is sore and tired. He hopes never, he never runs into a polar bear again. These two bears are so similar. Next time, the outcome could be quite different.